value of uh, universal gravitational constant is 6.6 into 10 power minus 11 newton meter square per kilogram square in SA system then find the value of that in cj system so it's so simple like uh, what concept are we going to use you know that one meter is equal to 100 centimeter so this is in SA system this is in cj system this is the number in cj system this is the number in SA system so this holds true for any system of units like number 1 into unit 1 in that system equal to number 2 and unit 2 in that system this is what we are going to use here so what is the number in SA system let's say uh, gravitational constants value in SA system is equal to 6.6 .6 into 10 power minus 11 newton meter square per kilogram square and the same in cj system the gravitational constants value in cj system let's keep it that way n2 is gc uh, the value in cj system and u2 is the unit in cj system so you don't know the value let's keep it as n2 into u2 so this is u1 basically this is n1 this is n2 and u2 basically is here newton equivalent unit in cj system is dyne and meter square that is centimeter square and kilogram power minus 2 here gram power minus 2 so that's how we are going to solve suppose if you know <coughs> 1 newton is actually 10 power 5 dyne you can directly go ahead doing this but you can also do it in a slightly different way by saying that 6.6 .6 into 10 power minus 11 newton newton is basically force so force is equal to mass into acceleration mass is in kilogram and acceleration is meter per second square so if you substitute the same for newton because basically the unit of force is newton so one newton is kilogram meter per second square if you do that kilogram meter per second square into meter square into kilogram power minus two basically i substituted this value for newton then what are we getting like 6.6 .6 into 10 power minus 11 kilogram into kilogram power minus 2 becomes kilogram power minus 1 meter into meter square becomes meter cube and second power minus 2 this is gravitational constants value in SI system so what is the same in CGS system gravitational constant value in CGS system we don't know the number that that's what we are going to find out in place of dyne centimeter square per second square this this is going to come in place of kilogram in place of dyne we will be using uh, gram centimeter per second square what we will be eventually we will get here kilogram power minus one here gram power minus one meter power three here centimeter power three and second power minus two here also it is second power minus two this is what we are going to use okay so n1 u1 is equal to n2 u2 so let's write that n1 n1 is 6.6 .6 into 10 power minus 11 here u1 is this is mass this is length this is time we are going to write like mass 1 that means the measure in say the number one system uh, which is minus 1 and <coughs> measure of length in first system l1 power 3 and this one time power minus 2 in the first system this is equal to gravitational constant in cj system which is n2 into here measure of mass in the second system power minus 1 measure of length power 2 in the second system three in the second system measure of time power minus two this is how we are going to write so what are we going to do now keep n2 here and bring everything else on the other side so 6.6 .6 into 10 power minus 11 so m1 power minus 1 l1 power 3 t1 power minus 2 by m2 power minus 1 l2 power 3 and this is actually t2 t2 power minus 2 and you can just remove this like this could be bracketed into ones this could be bracketed into ones this could be bracketed into one term so n2 is basically i am just writing n2 over here this over the other side 6.6 .6 into 10 power minus 11 the first term is 
m1 by m2 whole power minus 1 instead of m power minus 1 by m2 power minus 1 i am writing m1 by m2 whole power minus 1 then l1 by l2 whole power 3 and then t1 by t2 whole power minus 2 then this one is 6.6 .6 into 10 power minus 11 into m1 m1 is actually kilogram in the first system in the second system it is gram whole power minus 1 l1 is actually <coughs> meter this is centimeter whole power 3 and this is t1 which is second t2 is also second whole power minus 2 these two will be cancelled anything 1 power anything is again 1 so this is 6.6 .6 into 10 power minus 11 kilogram which is 1000 gram by gram whole power minus 1 this meter is 100 centimeter by centimeter we basically need to cancel those units we need to arrive at uh, this thing number so this is going to be 6.6 .6 into 10 power minus 11 then this is 1000 power minus 1 is 1 by 1000 into 100 power 3 is 10 power 6 actually I'm just writing it so 1 2 3 so 1 2 3 when you cancel it what are we getting number 2 is the numerical value in the second system which is 6.6 .6 into 10 power minus 11 into 1000 which is 10 power 3 so n2 equal to 6.6 .6 into 10 power minus 8 this is what the numerical value of gravitational constant in the second system so the gravitational constant in the CGS system here is 6.6 .6 into 10 power minus 8 the unit is still the same which is time centimeter square per gram square so which is dying centimeter square dying centimeter square per gram square so you can also do it in another way which I'll tell you how to do it